guys welcome back to another match day vlog we are back from the winter break people smash the like and subscribe button to chelsea fan tv on your way into the vlog it's chelsea versus plymouth in the fa cup it's a big week for us as well we've got potentially two fixtures in the club world cup as we go on our pursuit of becoming world champions as well as champions of europe but we've got to deal with the matter at hand first it's chelsea versus plymouth and we need the same level of performance that we showed against Chesterfield. We need to show the golfing class early and we need to kill the game early. We put out a very strong lineup, which I'm not too surprised about because let's be real, this, the players have been out for two weeks, so their sharpness would have gone down a little bit. So we do need to pick that up before the Club World Cup starts. There's probably a few of those teams in the Club World Cup that have been playing throughout those two weeks. They're so going to be in a much better position than we are. So it makes sense that we put out a strong lineup. But we also have to show that strength on the pitch because our performance over the last month and a half they've been very inconsistent and we do need to build up some consistency now now that we're in a break now that we've had a break the players have actually had a few weeks to relax which is exactly what they needed we've had so many fixtures from october up until the winter break so now we've had some rest let's make it count because we've been saying that's been one of the major reasons for why we've dropped in form so we need to actually show it on the pitch now that we've had a break let's head down to the ground let's see what happens and let's just hope this is a straightforward win see you soon up the chelsea Minutes to go. Kepa. Oh fucking hell. No. No VAR. First round target for Plymouth and they score. I swear out. We never make it easy. Never make it easy. What the fuck? How's it going? Out, out. We're getting moved to. We're getting moved to. Oh my gosh! Chuck! Chuck! What kind of a delivery is that, man? Low dribble crosses in a low block, like that's gonna work. Oh, Lukaku, do something. This guy, man. This guy. See at you again. Oh! I think so. Come on! Oh, yes!
Right, half time, Chelsea won, Plymouth won. I ain't even sit and try and pretend that was a good performance. We've been horrific this entire first half. We've just overloaded uh, Plymouth's defence to the point where eventually something was going to go in. Credit to Asby because that was a very good back heel, but we've been poor. In midfield, I think we've struggled in terms of, of trying to beat Plymouth's. Defensively, we've been suspect a few times, but I think AC and Rudiger have been all right. They've been our two better players today. Going forward, though, absolutely atrocious. Tro isn't taking anybody on. Lukaku's just standing there. Now, fair play, he got the assist for the goal, but like, he's had a poor first half as well. No one in the attacks played well for me. They've all struggled. Their distribution hasn't been good enough, and it's just been poor, typical, temp, um, poor crap crosses into the box that hasn't been going anywhere. We need to see better in the second half, but it might be a case of quality that's going to be the difference between both sides. But Plymouth have really been coming out for us in this game. They got a lot more confidence after they got the goal as well. We need to do a lot better in this second half because first half, we were not the better team by a mile. Have to see what happens in the second half. But so, do I say I'm confident? <laughs> I don't even know. Just need somebody to score, but see what happens in there. That's not been an inspiring first half. <laughs> You see this one going to penalties. Uh, I don't know how we're going to penetrate this team because we've just been struggling to do it the whole match. But well, one nice little back heel from Asbolo Kueta. We've had nothing. Literally, our decision making in the final third is horrific. It's so horrific. Oh, Alonso! This whole game, absolute mess. Go, 